Good morning! I'm Polarized Moon, and welcome back to A Right from the Stars. So we're making through it. We're making our way through the firmament now. Uh, hopefully I can get through this without breaking anything this time. Ooh, that was close. That was really close. No, what? Oh, I didn't click. That's really funny that we're still following the path. <laughs> I clicked it, but my my pathing was off. All right, let's try this again. I need to so I need to do loop around this twice because there's that uh, that that blue star that switches directions. Okay. So the thing is, I have to keep an eye both on where I am and where the cursor is for the star. Because because the camera moves, the star switches places on the on the frame of the of the in the framing of the the screen. So if I hold my see if I hold my my yeah, if I hold my mouse in the one spot, it won't be in the correct place when I click. Which is what I had a problem with just now. Okay, so now I wait for this. Oh, I missed the timing on that. Okay, great. So and now I do these things here. And I can switch positions to get through this. And then hit that. And then wait for those to go. And then I go down here. Um. So I need to get here, I think. Uh... Okay. I think I got it. Ye yes Okay, that just sent me back here. Whoa, what? <laughs> Was that a satellite? I don't know what that satellite was. Uh-oh. Oh, dang it. I want to see that satellite. That was hilarious. Hold on, let's 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 try to see that again. Hopefully that puts me back in a spot. Okay. Hold on, can I see the satellite again? No? Oh man. That would have been hilarious. Okay. So there. And there. Ooh, boy. Hey, there's the moon. Okay, cool. And... Oh, wait, what? Oh, I'm not supposed to... Okay, they need to launch me to the moon, I guess. Oh, man, I was so close. Oh, this is... This is an ordeal. Okay, this is a little bit easier. Okay, cool. Yay! I did it! I made it to the moon! At last, it has been ages since a Makoa child landed his feet on my skin. Okay. Congratulations, Kirm. You are truly unique. It is true. I know your name. I have been observing you since you were born. Now I will reveal to you the meaning of life, but come closer, this revelation is only for your ears. Fine, fair... Fairly then? I... Okay. I'm not entirely sure what that said. It was a little tiny. The Rock of Destiny. I have magic powers! Ooh. Where's Mr. Uh, Mr. Ma Matranui? Meto Meto Nui. This reminds me, like, the, the words here remind me of, 
little dance. The words remind me of, like, Bionicle. I have one on the shelf. Um... You can't see it, but it's right here. Uh, it's around the corner of the... the camera. Moon's influence protects from the lost animas. You are worthy of the path of spirit. Oh, cool. Okay, so does that mean that I can now walk... Oh, I got... Why... Why is that way off to the left there? Is that because it took me so long to do that? Oh, did... Did the the old man have to build it himself? Is that why this one's so janky? Because the other one is, like, perfectly straight up. Okay. I can't believe you finished the Path of Spirit. And why not? Well, because... Kyomi is a lad full of resources. I am not denying it, but there is something... Enough. He has returned with the revelation, so the Path of Spirit is complete. Yes, yes, don't you worry. I am not avoiding my responsibilities. Come with me, young boy. I can't... Well, I suppose there is something inside your big head after all. Now stay quiet. Uh, okay, cool. More dancing. Oh. Okay. That is all. Do not disturb me again. So do I take this thing? Congratulations, Kirim. You have chosen your mastery over the three paths. And you only need to complete the final right. Stand right here when you feel ready. Okay, so do I take this thing now? Don't touch that scamp. Okay, I guess not. So can I switch... Um... Can I switch worlds at any time now? Nope, okay. Alright. So I'm supposed to go... Okay, so this shows me all the things that I've collected, right? Okay, so I'm missing... I mean, I'm missing quite a few. But I, I'm going to do that on my own time, try to find all those. Uh, but I guess I'm supposed to go over here now. I still never figured out what these guys' deal was. This feels like it's something... I feel like that's a secret of some kind, and I'm not entirely sure what it is. But let's go finish the final rite. The rite of passage. Okay. I'm standing here. Oh, I'm supposed to stand in a little circle. The time has come. For the final rite. Ha! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm nervous. There is only one thing you need to become a man. To be able to assume decision making and face a choice with all its consequences. That. Are you all right? Yes, yeah, just a little nervous. Keep going with the ritual, ritual speech, both of you. This guy does not like me. It is so irregular, but so be it. I don't want to argue anymore tonight. You must choose one of us to join you in the final right. Of course, the trial you will face will be different depending on who you choose. 
Uh, use your best judgment in choosing. Which one of us do you choose to join you in the final right? Are you willing to be, me to be the one to join you? Yeah, of course. I mean, sure, why not? Yes. And it's okay, you have the right to make the decision. Let's return to the temple of yesterday for the last time. Okay, so what is our right at the temple of yesterday? I do know this game has multiple endings. Uh, I won't be showing off all the endings here with you guys. You guys can go check them all off yourselves. And I know there's a bunch of you that I gave this game to. Uh, well, at least there are ten of you. Ten of you I gave this game to. Dawns at the Temple of Yesterday have always been my favorites. However, I don't expect you to see this one. Not with these eyes, at least. You begin to understand, right? Difficult choices, sacrifices, survival. I told you all about them on this very place. I was talking, among other things, about this moment. By choosing for me your final right, your destiny is the new, to be the new chief. And for that, you will have to kill me. Ah. Uh, don't worry, my soul will prevail as a former chief. I will have my own mission. Although, if you think you are not capable of that, you can renounce your choice by dying at my hand. But please, don't do that to me. I know you will be a good leader, much better than I. I don't want to kill him. But, uh, I guess I have to. I'm ashamed of myself, for I have felt fear of you t for you tonight. A useless fear because it was clear you would overcome every trial. I am very proud of you, but it will be an honor ending my life by your hand. Ah. Sacrifice must take place on the throne. Your options are sitting on it or wielding the knife. But once again, I will ask you to be strong and kill me. Uh, okay, I... Uh, I'm gonna do it. What is this plant over here? A plant only blooms once per generation. A flower that lasts barely a night. Is that Audrey too? Don't you dare uproot it. It is the soul of the temple of yesterday. Okay. Why is there an Audrey too here? That's weird. Alright, I guess I'm gonna take the knife. Go ahead, take it with a firm hand. Do it for the Makoa. The tribe is more important than you and me. <sighs> okay, here we go. Oh, that's right, I have to right click to take things. I forgot. Since the moment your hands closed around that hilt, you have become a man. I am immensely happy, my son. It is curious. I always thought it would be much more uncomfortable. That's why he didn't let me sit in the chair before. No, it's not how you are supposed to do it. Go to the flower and spill your blood upon it. The throne will know what to do. Oh, is this a giant mouth? <laughs> this is Audrey too. Wow. <laughs> yeah, it's a giant teeth. There's a mouth. Is that you, Master? Wow. Wow. He just got et by Audrey, too. Oh. Oh, and then it revitalizes 
Wow. Tears of Pride. Artwork unlocked. Is that the end of the game? The paths have been completed, the final rite has taken place, and the guiding star has bore witness. And despite anguish, tears, and pain, Kirim has succeeded, a legend born from sacrifice. Returning to the village seems weird, as if nothing had happened. Three masters left, and three masters return. However, a new era begins the Makoa under the Aegis of their new and silent chief. Oh, is that him? The Makoa's future is in good hands. Oh, no, that's the that's her. Maybe that is him. Do they turn into stars when they die? I don't I don't know. Congratulations! You have passed your right from the stars and become a legend among the Makoa. As such, you must leave your transitional name behind and choose the one that suits your feats. Ailani. Moon! Do you want to be the, your- do you want that to be your name from now on? Yes. Aww. Uh -huh. Credits? Yeah! Oh man, this game was fantastic. I had a really good time with this game. Um, as always, I'm gonna let these credits roll because these these people are just as important uh, in the creation of this game as I am. Or in th these people are just as important with this uh, for this series as I am for playing it and for you guys for watching it. So we're always gonna go through these and let the uh, let these go. Oh man, this game was great. I had a, I had a great time with it. I, I I know there's a bunch of different endings. So if you guys want to go and tell me which endings you guys got. Uh, go tell me in the comments below. I would really like to know. Um, yeah. <laughs> Starring Kerm as himself, Mirk as himself, as Hoku, narrator, trailers, Carlos Hernando. Yeah, okay. So, so I'm recognizing some of these names. Um, I'm recognizing some of these names. Sopranos, Alto. Oh, did, oh, those are the singers. For the singing. Oh, the cor. Oh, wow. Oh, there was an actual chorus in this game. That's amazing. I had no idea. Additional chorus voices. Wow. That is so cool. Nostalgia. Tribute to classic video games. I'm gonna have to watch that. Pop oh, short films. Oh, there's all sorts of there's all sorts of other things in here. Oh man, party goer, Kickstarter campaign. Yeah, I bet I bet all those names in the stars were the people from the Kickstarters. Testing identified testers. Ah. Huh. Okay, cool. Do they have unidentified testers? I don't know. I don't know what that would mean. Wow. Unidentified testers. They didn't leave. Oh, they didn't leave a surname. Okay. There are unidentified testers. Alberto. Oh, completely different. A brand new Alex. Oh, I love that. That's great. Oh my gosh, another Borgia. Borgia? Bjorn? Bjorn? Wow, wow, there's gonna be a lot of these. Carlos, another one. Maybe Carlos? <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. There's a lot of Carlos. Man, we're only into E's. David, a lot of Davids. I love the little, I love the little flavor text, that's great. Elena, they come in pairs. <laughs> Fernando, not the last backer. <laughs> not the other Fernando. Gloria, not the same Gloria. Gonzalo, the second Gonzalo. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, that's hilarious. Javier, another one. 
Caviar, let's call him the third. Javier the third. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, there's the little, um... There's the... the... the satellite. Kevin is a popular name. Julia, the daughter of the other Julia? <laughs> Oh, there's no, there's no, no flavor text here. I like the flavor text. Oh, it's like a slideshow of, it's like an animated slideshow, because that thing is going across the edges. Was I not paying attention to that before? So, yeah, I like how each different section of the game, you, you got a different, like a completely different game mechanic and you had to like each segment you had to relearn but it was essentially the same I really liked that 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 final segment with the with the the switching in between the worlds that was really cool and I loved the the art style they had there had there and just turning the turning the stone things into living things was really cool being able to like the the what do you call it the uh the, the juxtaposition between the the juxtaposition between the the like the, the the lava and the red and the dying things and the bright purples and the highlighted things thanks a lot for your generosity kindness and your patience oh we're at we're at the end of the backers people thanks if we forgot someone please forgive us ah uh, that was <laughs> more people <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Our little home. That's great. Special thanks, Jose Manuel Blanco Blasco. I thank you of these for unconditional support in this epic feat. My whole family and friends and whoops. I love Brandy, the source of my joy and my commitment to rising goat. I can't imagine a life without every single minute. I'd like to thank Oh oh, these are specific things written by Thankful be made simple, not like- Oh my gosh. Secondly, I really, really want to thank you for the consistency. There's no way I can read all this. I'm gonna have to pause these and read them while I'm editing. Between the long development of this project, wouldn't have been possible that I could just support my family and closest friends. Being so great and really hard for others. <laughs> Being so great is really hard for others. Oh my gosh. It's amazing that we've managed to get here. To the credits. It means that we have finished the game and you too, dear player, well done. I encourage you to try other endings. I will. Thanks, Dad, for being such a fantastic person and father. Always with me and missing you always. I will, I will personally... <laughs> oh, no. But that's actually really funny there. Oh, and those must be all the people in Goat Masks. <laughs> Rising Goat. Thanks for playing. Oh man, that was great. I personally will be going back and doing the other endings because I want to see what else there is. Um, but thank you guys for watching. Uh, I think that's everything. Yeah. All right. So we're at the end. Uh, that's about all the time I've got for this episode. Like and subscribe if you like the episode. Ring that bell if you'd like to see more. Good night, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.